It's an installation designed by Frank Gehry, but it's like being inside of a Ken Price. And interestingly, um, Gehry owns a number of works of, of, of Price. And he was interested as an architect, what did these sculptures look like from the inside? And in fact, one of the sculptures that he owns, 100% pure, he subjected to a very special kind of high-tech kind of imaging to see what the inside looked like. Without question, the understanding of how these sculptures are made, what the space feels like, perhaps inside, certainly on the outside, overhangs, they're architectural, they're voids. All of this, I think, comes through in a very subtle way, in a very intuitive way, in the installation. The idea to do this exhibition, which I think is really long overdue, was something that I had been noodling about for, for quite some time and about four years ago found that you know the timing the timing would be would be right. It's a, a monographic exhibition after Pacific Standard Time and I think allows us to um, zero in to kind of um, focus on the work of one of the artists who uh, created a lot of stir and a lot of, there was a lot of attention to his work in a number of exhibitions of Pacific Standard Time, so the timing is perfect. The only way that the timing's not perfect is a kind of sad one. Um, Price was already ill um, with cancer when I um, approached him about doing the retrospective, and we knew that it was um, going to be a challenge to see if he would actually make it to the opening of the exhibition. Sadly, he died in February of 2012, about six months before we opened the exhibition. One of the things that, that I proposed to, to Price was that we present the exhibition in reverse chronological order. Now, most artists are most interested in the work that they're doing at the time, not in 30 years old, old work. They're kind of curious about seeing it all together, but it's not usually what they want to begin with. So he loved that idea. And I think that the installation really underscores his work as a sculptor by beginning with some of these, um, the, re the recent work.